feel better. Whatever's hurting you. Everything will feel better. Everything will feel better. It'll be a little sore, but it'll all feel better. It'll all be good. <laughs> it's a little bit. It's a little bit. What's going on, guys? Malik. Welcome to the Coach Malik Show. My name is Malik Manoon, and I am going to be your virtual coach. I'm going to give you the knowledge, the tips, and the advice to help you perform better in all aspects of your life. Check this out. <laughs> See, I'm a gangster, know where to find me. All right, guys, so today we hit legs. It was leg day. We started off with uh, RDL, single leg. Highly recommended. Obviously, as you guys watch any of my videos, I do those almost every leg day. Then with the back squats, not too heavy, sets of eight. And then we went to leg curl, and then we went to walking dumbbell lunges. Highly recommended walking dumbbell lunges for you know beginner, intermediate, or advanced. Back squat is more advanced. Um, you know, single leg RDLs, a little bit more advanced, maybe do doubles, but walking lunges, you could do them with, you know, body weight, you could do them with light weights, you could do them with heavy weights. Highly recommend doing those, you can get a great, uh, great leg workout. It's also gonna work not only your quads, but your hamstrings, your glutes, your core. It's gonna work a lot of your body. So definitely walking lunges. And then we ended off with the fun, fun superset with leg extensions. As you guys can see, we did no rest. We went one set 15, switched up with Jordan, switched cameras. He did 15, then I did 15, he did 15, I did 15, he did 15. If you have a training partner you go to gym with, highly recommend you two do this. Tag your gym buddy in the comments and do this workout with them. Uh, guys, I really hope you got value from this workout. Hopefully you try this out yourself with your gym partner, share it. If you guys like this video, got some value from it, smash the like button, subscribe to the channel. And as always, I will see you next workout. Still in Bay, my uncle moved to Kane. My cousin rapped and my daddy sold booty tang. Bought a pound to the perp, threw it in the range. Sent it out to turn around like a boomerang. Louis V. Bell. During RDLs, just wanna make sure that your back, your chest, your spine, and that leg that you're kicking out is all on a straight line as much as possible. And you're engaging that glute that you're lifting. Another thing is you wanna make sure that your hips don't twist too much. So when you get down here, you don't want to twist your hips, you want to keep your hips square to the ground. As you're coming down, squeezing your glute, contract your, your hamstring that you're working. Try those out if you really enjoy them. They'll help a lot with knee pain and a lot with speed if you're an athlete. And a lot with overall glute activation. It'll help with back pain. All good stuff. RDLs, as you guys know, highly recommend it. going on guys so Jordan just brought up a good point when we we're working out he talked about his hamstring feeling better after what two weeks of working out about two weeks of working out our legs yeah, yeah, so weeks. explain to me or explain to uh, the viewer right now like what you were talking about when your hamstring felt tight like beforehand and then like after working out for a couple weeks you, you literally two weeks right just two, two weeks, weeks. Yeah. what's the difference it's made on your on your hamstrings feeling tight and stuff like that right so I've always had like really tight hamstrings they didn't really take care of my legs it's yeah. always been really tight kind of rock hard before I stretch them out so it always hard. be a pain to get them loose you know um, and after about just two times of working out, your hamstrings doing de deadlifts, hamstring curls, lunges, all RDLs. Those, RDLs, all those type of things, my hamstrings just uh, generally just feel looser, naturally yeah. feel looser, and uh, less tight. Less tight, just not yeah. as tight anymore, and it's made a huge difference already. Like I have to stretch, I don't have to stretch as much, and it's just it's a huge pain to lift it off my shoulders already so guys two weeks yeah so just start whatever you you know as soon as you get that spark as soon as you get that inspiration to start working out just start you know you had the inspiration a couple weeks ago you reach out to me we started what that next monday next monday yeah right on it right on it because as soon as you wait as soon as you ponder no as soon way, as you think about it, it yeah just get it just to it goes on and on so do what jordan did just get to it just get started as soon as you can your hamstrings will feel better your back will feel better whatever's hurting you everything will feel better everything will feel better it'll be a little sore but it'll all feel better it'll all be good <laughs> slow it slow it all right guys <laughs>